Hello guys, this is uh, SSHX Vengeance here, yet again, with another shitty fucking voiceover video. I'm sick of doing these now because they are driving me insane having to sit here and talk shit about other bad kids. Okay, so, let's have a look at fucking Highcom again, okay, let's have a look at Kurt the fat fucking seal who clearly doesn't know how competitive works. He talks about how I'm planning on getting all these BK sweats into playing the game for him, but, wait there, coincidentally, Last time uh, I recall High Common SOH having a confliction, we asked you for a 4v4. Now, you refused, and then a few weeks later it was like, oh yeah, 4v4 right now. We showed up, and you've got these fucking randoms together. Okay, so now let's let's look at it again, okay? Um, we get together this time, and we say, okay, let's fucking 8v8. And since we've asked for that 8v8, they've tried every possibility to get out of 8v8ing us. They've been sat there saying, oh, you need a 4v4, this random ass guy's team, whatever they're called. Oh, you need to play this team before you can play us. And it's like, why? You're just, you're just backing out of an 8v8. But now, all of a sudden, Kurt's just decided, oh, um, let me just cro let me just go and ask like, some more fucking sweats of Halo to see if they'll play for my shit clan. Okay, so now all of a sudden that we've asked for an 8 v he's like, oh, we'll do an 8 v But it's not his team. He's just going to pull in some fucking randoms. And then he's trying to be all hypocritical about them going, oh, yeah, Joe, you're not pulling randoms. But he's allowed to pull in randoms, okay. So let's lay it down this way, okay, Kurt. I will use 100% my members, okay. If you want, I will read out my lineup now. And I can tell you all, if you ask any of them, they are in the SOH, okay. So I will be playing Sniper, Hodor is Moist, Myself, X Venators V, Shrekist, Simplicity, um, possibly Hazardite. Let me have a look down now. Probably Rathbot. I could play UNSC Spartan, Torbinator, Wave, possibly Inferno. I'm not going to play Demony shit. For BTB anywhere. Flibub, I could play Flibub. Yeah, Mrs. Blitz. Shock Overlord. SOHX Horizon. The Eskimo. Okay. Now these guys will probably be a range of people who will possibly be in that 8v8. We don't necessarily know 100% good lineups inside. We've run on different games, and we haven't really been focusing on reach. But we will still play you as long as you use your members, and you are not bringing in some random sweats and then saying to us, "Oh, you know, you're using fucking unlegit members." I know who's in your clan. I've seen you put that APA against Golden Eagles up, and I know for a fine fact they were your legit members. Because they're all geeky, nerdy little sad bastards who want to be fucking, oh, let's be military, do raids all the time. Well, it's not going to cut it this time. You're going to step onto our level, you're bringing your fucking guys onto our level. We're not stepping down onto your level for a shitty raid because we're competitive players. And we like to play competitive players. But if you're going to sit there and get competitive players in from a different clan to play for you, you've got to think again. So if you want to play us, I want your team. And I've got pictures of your team here from them 8 v you posted on YouTube or other clan members of yours have posted on YouTube. And I'm looking at who your members are now and what ranks they are, what their game attacks are. So I don't want you coming to me with new accounts saying, oh yeah, well, you joined my clan a week ago. No, nah, I'm not pulling any of it. I know who your legit members are. I'm looking in your videos and I can see who you play. And I can also see who you tend to use in your lobbies with what other people have told me. I know who's in your high com lobbies most of the time from what I used to get told or what I used to see myself when I had you as a friend myself. So don't be trying to pull any bullshit. I know your team and I want your team there. No random sweats from either team. Your team, Kurt. And I want you on that team as well. Me and you have got to meet in that game so I can out-DMR you and teabag you and slap your body like the little bitch you are. Just to sit you military fucks down thinking you're boss of the community. I know for a fine fact, SOH will probably sit there and spawn kill you in both games if you use a lot of your legit members. But you think you have a fighting chance because you're going to pull in some random sweats 
and you think we're going to lose all of a sudden, well, here's it for you. If you want us to play random sweats, after we've beaten your legit team, we will play your these random scrubs or whatever. We don't care. But some random scrubs beat us who you who you claim to be in your clan. I don't fucking care about. I want to play your legit members because I know for a fine fact Highcom's legit members are absolute trash. I've seen you play, I've seen your teamwork, I've seen how you pan out. Your tactics are shit, your communication's shit. And I know for a fine fact if SOH's team stepped up against you, you get spawn killed. On Hemorrhage, Boneyard, Boardwalk. They're like the main three maps that we ever play. So if we play you Highcom, we want to play you on Hemorrhage. And Boneyard. Okay. So get your facts right. No sweat. Out of the team. We'll play this. Whatever t Whoever this guy is. This random guy. You're randomly licking his ass now to play for you. We will play his team after we've played yours. That sounds like a fair deal. I'd say. And if you refuse to these terms. I'm not going to say you're forfeit. Because it's necessarily only a forfeit. If you accept it and don't show it to a game. Someone says no, knows no, it's not a forfeit, it's like, it's like going to someone, oh yeah, do you want to fight? No, forfeit. It's not that, it's like, if they don't want to fight, they don't want to fight. But not for a fine fact, you're not going to use our legit members if we just set that out straight away. So, I want you to play to these terms, which is the terms most clans play by and most clans do. It's a best of three clan match, okay, so... Two game if pe if like our team wins two games, we don't do a third. If it comes to a one hour situation, we play a third. Okay. Then after that, it's done. Besides that, we want standard rules. So we will have the T U B T B Slayer, no modifications, the maps with no modifications. Uh, except the hemorrhage one which will be slightly modified because we are not using the original one with scorpions we will be using the ones with wraiths which is tu and um, boneyard still the same so it didn't get updated with tu so them two then the two we'll be using there'll be no edited parts of the map let me think what else could we do besides that it's just legit members and stuff so I don't really see anything else happening. And Kurt, if you're watching this, I don't care. I'm not messaging any sweat of yours, which you like. You want to go and fucking lick his bum all squeaky clean. I'm not playing no random sweat that you can get. Because I know for a fine fact, if you're going to bring a sweat, if you're going to bring a legit members in, right, I'll go and have a word with the RSL. I can go and have words with RFDL. I go talk to FX. I could go and talk to other BTV teams. And I could bring them in if you're going to sit there and be like that and say, oh, I'm going to bring. Well, coincidentally, Joe. This uh, BTV team's just joined my clan. Uh, just shot, like, just as we wanted to refuse to do a clan match with you. Yeah, sure, Kurt. I know who your legit members are. I'm looking at your Golden Eagles game now. I'm looking at you, Jerome, Joshua, Otto, Robert, Stardust, Samuel, Takedown, Victor. I'm looking at your members. So, if I don't see your members there, then unfortunately, no game's going to go down. So, if you get any members there... If one of your members is not officially in your clan, I will kick them all. And I don't want no second account, so like no new account, so I don't want anyone going, oh, his account got banned, blah, 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 because it could be one of your sweat strand hikes. I know what you're like, uh, you'll do anything to scrape a win, because you're cheap like that. So, no second account. I want the original accounts of your members from your clan, and we will do the same, okay? That sounds fair. If you don't agree to these, Kurt... You can always take your military shit and go and shove it up your ass. There we go. You want to step onto the big field 8v8 with the big boys. You're going to play like and with the big boys. So let's see what happens when Kurt denies these rules and sits there saying we forfeited. Because we're not playing some random shit team he's going to pull in. We will play them after we've played you. Because then we won't care about the results. We will have beaten your legit team and that's all we care about. Okay, that's me done anyway.